I'm going to show you the church of Gustav Adolf, a most beautiful place. Well, here we are. Let me take you inside this most beautiful church and churchyard here in Gustav Adolf. A remarkable place with a chandelier that glows with beauty and charm. A beautiful churchyard and a beautiful church. Here from 1781. You imagine what the world was like in 1781. Let alone Hogfosh Kamir. When you see the chandeliers in this place, you'll find them very impressive. Well, here we are. Let's walk in to this beautiful house of God. In Gustav Adolf Church, I found this man playing the violin. He enchanted me, not only because of his beautiful graphic Swedish looks, but the sound of his music was incredible. He told me he'd been playing now for 50 years. He teaches 50% of the time, and 50% of the time he is playing music as a way of earning an income but also for the enjoyment of life and love. Please, listen.
you must now admit that that was enchanting in a beautiful way. And I suggest for each and every one of you, one, listens to the violin and watch the movie Fiddler on the Roof. Once you've watched that movie, you can understand the enchantment of this handsome and beautiful Swedish man. Wasn't that enchanting? Here, so beautiful here, above the lake of Diglund. It's, it's just a wonderful place to be. In the middle of summer, the feeling, well, I've got to say, it's hard to beat it with this beautiful bell tower at the back. What a fantastic, beautiful place to be. And there you can see the lake. Welcome to the Church of Gustav Adolf. <laughs> 